What's up guys, my name is Jyotik and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be teaching you how to make a gaming background like this one. So, uh, to start this, first you need is go, go to your browser and search for YouTube channel art size. Uh, you can download any one but, you know, I like this one so you just need to click right click so picture as and wait for some time and just save it so i wanted to save it so once you have downloaded it go for shop file new and with 2560 and night 1440 so just click ok good file place and place the file which you have downloaded so i have it here so there you go now what you want to cover is the TV area, which is you know this one, this gray boxes. You need to cover this with you know any background color. Um, so I'll be choosing you know kind of cyan like, and I'm gonna color it. So just cover it using. Uh, I'm sorry, this is not a rectangle tool. Just use a rectangle tool and just cover it. Cover the both gray sides and so you can see the dark gray tool dark gray box uh in this area you can see the a banner in mobile phone in the other gray area you can see in tablets in the whole gray area you can see in you know laptops computers or whatever so once you have done that you can now delete la this layer so Let's get started. First, go to the brush tool. Uh, make sure it is on brush tool, not any other tool. And select any of these white ones. And make the size as 25 or uh, 25. And then go to pen tool, not any other tool. Just go to pen tool and draw some lines. So just draw some whatever lines. Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Forgot something. Before doing this, you need to first create a new layer. Uh, once the layer is selected, you need to draw some lines. So just draw some lines. So there you go. Once you have draw, drew, drew those lines, just go, just right click, stroke path, and on the default it will be on pencil. You just need to click on brush. Hit OK. So it's you know kind of light, and also. It is cyan color. We needed black color, so just I'm gonna hit Control Z and make the background as black. Right click, stroke path, and make sure it is on brush and click OK. So it is you know kind of light. So to do make it dark, you just need to hit it you know kind of many times. So, I'm sorry, not the full path. So this looks good for me just now once you have done it you just need to click delete two times and there you go now you need to put the layer beneath two rectangles and you can you know now move those so i'm gonna put it right over here now to add some pictures you just need to go to browser and search for any game like i'm gonna choose battlefields battle for the full wallpaper so i'm Mm, so just wait for it and select any of the image uh, available here so I, I'm going to select this one just wait for it to be clear and you just need to right click download and you can download as many images as you want so now just say you can even view, pre view image or you can just directly once the uh, image is clear just right click save picture as and also uh, whatever you want to name it then go to photoshop replace didn't add there you go guys so once you have download once you have just placed it you just need to position somewhere but first we need to put it all below the layer one and then hold ctrl t and resize it uh, i'm gonna resize it like you know a kind of bigger a more bigger so this looks good 
once you have placed it just right click rasterize the layer then go to erase it too and just uh, to make it easy you just need to zoom so to zoom hold alt and scroll down scroll up i'm sorry and to move sidewards hold control and scroll up and down so now just erase the image after the black line here um, you can see the image has become kind of lighter the line is kind of lighter oh I'm sorry um, there you go no need to erase it so just hold alt and scroll down and you can zoom out into um, so guys just do the same process I have I already have some images so outlast and just put it down control T resize it so this looks good right click rasterize the layer erase it to uh, control alt alt to zoom in sorry I'm gonna just first erase this uh, erase there you go just erase the whole bunch of things you know, it's kind of taking time but it's an easy process so I'm gonna play some more images like watchdogs um, this game is you know kind of awesome so I'm gonna just resize the image right where the man is in there you go right click rasterize layer alt to zoom in and remove the image. um there you go and just remove it uh, so if you don't want to erase it after placing two to three images you just need you have a simple process which I'm going to show you now like um, multi combat I'm just going to resize it to whatever you want it you know I'm just going to place it right uh, there you go and I'm going to drag it down and now you don't need to erase this whole thing you don't, you don't even need to rasterize the layer and just place another file like um, I'm gonna put a Call of Duty just resize it and you know kinda of put it right over there and make uh, put it right below every layer oh, I'm sorry so now you need to erase that rasterize layer hold alt and just erase this that's all so now there you go we got a gaming clutch now if you want to have some interesting just add some text uh, so uh, select the text tool add some text I'm gonna put it as to uh, I'm sorry guys the font is you know kinda not so good just I will put it everything on top of it I'm gonna choose the American captain you know, if you don't know how to download the font, just check out my other, other video. So just type, I'm gonna type tutorial. And you can, you can change the color, you can change the size, you can change the font, and you can put it right in the middle of whatever side you want it. And so I'm gonna delete this layer, it's an extra layer. So now, you know to I'm sorry select the text and to place it in the middle make sure the layer is selected click control A the layer align layer selections vertical centers layer align layer selections horizontal centers there you go it's right in the center so now you know you can add here your, uh, to deselect the layer or click control D now you can add your Twitter Facebook Instagram or whatever or we can even add some guns like I'm gonna show you now like this gun 
you can get it on images just if you type you know came and rotate it in and a half and then go to blending options by right clicking on it sorry and go to drop shadow capacity 100 distance 0 you can put it to 44 uh, 44 44 44 um 22 so this looks good you can add some money for guns to your channel and now so where are the other guns you know that i'm not using this because jpg file we need some png files png there you go we got another uh, we got another gun uh, i'm sorry for this hold shift and resize it and tick so to um, you know copy the same layer style just right click copy layer style right click paste layer style and there you go you can add some other images like smileys uh, like this thing but as it is gaming I'm adding guns just to add smiley here and just paste layer style you can add multiple smileys so once you have everything done the file save as and name it whatever you want. I'm gonna tutorial one or whatever you know. Oh, that's not the correct spelling. Tutorial. And there you go. Just make it JPG and just save. Okay, and there you go, guys. So, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, comment, and keep watching. Yeah.